It's Pride Week in North Bay, a day set aside for love and celebrating one's authentic self. The dress I decided to make, it was a wedding dress, which is a celebration, and I took all of the hateful words, um, faggot, queer, all those kind of things, and put them on this dress and made them glittery and said, you know what, I'm going to take the hate, I'm going to own it, I'm going to make it something beautiful, and I'm going to say, this is me, and damn well, I'm going to look good doing it. Mayor Shiriko helped weave the parade through downtown, ending at the band shell, and there was positive feedback, most here taking pride in how their community has evolved into one inclusive city. And it's about celebrating our differences and bringing everyone together, because when we bring our differences together, we can build so much more. The costumes were colorful, the music loud, there was dancing, waving, and plenty of smiles. It makes me really proud. It makes me feel like the community is truly a community. It's important to stand up in support of uh, all our citizens. Organizers say this is about promoting love and acceptance, taking a stand against some of the hate that's popped up against this community. And hey, if they have a little fun at the same time while they're doing it, why not? When I was younger, like even 10, 10 years ago, there was nothing here. Um, I didn't even know, to be honest, what a lesbian was. So I think um, not only is there a huge sense of pride, but there's a huge sense of finally feeling like I have a community. Educators, the United Church, and armed service men and women from the local base all in attendance. One of the biggest turnouts came from organized labor. It included even the president of QP himself. It serves as like a beacon. Not only for the people in this community, but frankly, for small and northern communities all across the province to show that our communities are welcoming. There has been too much focus on hate. We cannot focus on the hate. We need to focus on the love and the positivity, the diversity and the inclusion. Celebrating a love they hope will continue to extend across the city, the region and beyond. Ian Campbell, CTV News, North Bay.